Here's what you told us in 2012 when we mm -hmm. did that story about you and your parents. Right. You said that uh, she, she didn't parent us. Right. Uh, she's more like a big sister. Mm -hmm. She was Peter Pan. Well, Peter Pan is the boy who never grew up. Yeah. Or never wanted to grow up. And my mom never did grow up. My mom lived to 97 years old and she stayed Peter Pan with her p signature Peter Pan colors her entire existence. But you said she didn't parent you. She was more of an advisor than a parent. The game that she loved to play with me was simply when I, was, when I came home with a big problem or I was mad at somebody. She would always say, well, how do you think that person feels? Oh, how and, smart. And it's kind of like, well, why, are you, why are you taking his side? I'm not taking his side, Steve. But what do you think that person was you know, feeling when he made you feel bad? That's what psychiatrists do. Now I see why you didn't need therapy. You were having it all along <laughs> maybe, from your mother. Maybe. But so she was a partner and kind of let me talk my way through my own problems. But she didn't preach and she didn't do the parental. She didn't have the, you know, the list that she could tick off. You rarely have a central character who broods. You know, I'm not a brooding guy. I don't, I don't brood, you know, yeah. and I'm optimistic, and I've always been that way. But I also know how to embrace tragedy. I know how to embrace darkness. I've made a lot of movies that are very dark. So I know what it's like to deep dive into something um, like Schindler's List or like Saving Private Ryan or like Amistad. I know, I know what it's like to go to the dark side, and I'm fine with that because I, 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 I feel that's an important, those messages are important to, to leave behind. But on something like this where there was so much variety that I've experienced in my life, I couldn't just focus on the darkness. I just wouldn't do that. It would have been a lie about how I feel.